I don't say he's a great man. Willie Loman never made a lot of money. This was not a role that I anticipated playing. Uh, uh, as an actor of color, this was a role that I uh, didn't think anyone would ask me to play, you know, uh, traditionally. This interpretation with an African-American family is the Loman family and adds uh, another variable of, um, of, of obstacle and conflict uh, to what was naturally happening in the play already. I put 34 years into this firm and now I can't pay my insurance. You can't eat the orange and throw the peel away. This was the first role that ever made me contemplate um, being careful uh, and making sure that I do something to disconnect from the role because uh, I was seeing all of those things in myself. You have to explore it in yourself. Um, are my best days behind me? Uh, uh, your own dysfunctions, um, your own insecurities. And when you really do that sort of self-examination, um, it has an impact on you. Uh, getting an opportunity to do the play the second time around, transferring it to the West End, um, there's uh, parts of the play that I want to dig a little deeper. It's one of those uh, plays and one of those roles that the complexity of it deserves uh, uh, multiple uh, shots at it. I had an opportunity to reconnect with a lot of my uh, Wire castmates uh, who are here in London. So uh, this play has been uh, really reuniting um, not only people from The Wire, but uh, all of my classmates from Juilliard. I invited the Duchess of Sussex uh, at the time. She was in the midst of uh, bringing Archie into the world, you know. So uh, uh, she and the Prince are patrons of the arts here uh, in London and in England. So hopefully this time around she'll be able to come. This is my London debut. I came here 40 years ago and always dreamed of coming back and being an actor. And uh, so this is a dream come true and nothing will ever top that.